Oh yes, I made it alive Make it so dry, get it to paradise In this moment of mine, I can't recognize See that the glare is bright so that is the ab session done. I kind of feel like hitting some arms though. Like with my first four weeks on the street with the program I do, I don't really hit enough like biceps. I only just do it on chest day. Um, so I'm just gonna do a bit of extra biceps now and stuff for my cardio. You can edit it anyway. <laughs> and then so what I'm thinking, right? Yeah. And you just you just pan in front of me. Oh yeah, the pan, slow yeah. pan, nice just, and smooth. Just imagine it. And, and get angles that my arms are good. Okay, no worries. Okay. Focus. Oh, look how big my arms are up there. This is about you. Make sure your hands on this. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I won't put K then. Keep going. Yeah, he's good. So keep going. Come on. That's it. How oh, bad for. After an hour's cardio. Yeah, no, I've I seen that. You're going pretty was, good, eh? Isn't there watching the guys in the pull up move record? Oh, yeah. Oh, How crazy is that? Hey, you got like. You got what, was, what was the record? He was 5659 five, in six hours. And I think he got about 5'6. He's like 100 10, off or something? No, it was, it was less than that. He was like 50 off. Wow. Ah. So what is going down people just here packing some orders i'll do a shout out right now michelle hornack she's from south australia and she just bought a few things so thanks for your support michelle uh jacob harris from victoria shout out to you and wayne birch from Bouldercombe. and i just packed another one what i just packed over there Shout out to everyone who's been ordering. Just currently tidying up this desk again. I don't know what happens, it just gets messy like all the fucking time. Now another thing I've done, fucking stocks the fuck up the short shelf here. So here we have light tans, greens, new oatmeals, the blacks. Now tracks are down here, the dark greys and the khaki greens. It's feeling a bit better here in this room now that it's that's all on the shelves and I'm not sleeping next to a bunch of boxes. So current plans for today actually just initiating the conversion to Australian Post from fast food couriers a little bit more expensive uh but i'm still gonna keep charging ten dollars for the shipping and then i'm actually i'm a bit confused on the express versus the standard i think the express isn't too much more if it's not too much more i'm actually willing to keep charging ten dollars flat rate for the australian shipping and then you guys get an express service which is something i really wanted to do most of our orders go to australia and if you're like not in queensland or new south wales in like city areas you know you could be waiting like six to ten days for your package whereas like the dhl ones going to us get there in like two days so it's like people in america are getting shipped before you guys in australia which is kind of like stupid as fuck really definitely working on that hopefully i can get this express op express option uh down packed so that's exciting i'll keep you guys updated hopefully we'll have it all ready for the other uh, launch uh february 9th see the worst it's annoying because sometimes i've got stock ready uh like well before launch and i can show you well in advance like two three weeks but this one probably won't be getting the stock till like a week before the launch so it's just going to be like a real big week of hype which i think is kind of cool like doing like kind of like a shorter kind of hype launch you know it's a week of just like fuck not like oh people waiting for like three weeks like you guys i mean you've already seen the new shorts and you're like ah oh, waiting three weeks and four weeks even it's just like how does it feel you tell me i can't imagine it feel too good so ideally don't really want to have people waiting for a product once they see it for more than like two to three weeks and um anyway so i'm gonna i'm gonna organize this shit Come on, Friesma. Right, we're doing this. Come on, man. Are you ready? Johan Spesh. All right. I'm waiting. Oh! Hello. Yeah, boy. Keep going. Get it. Yeah, Jay. <laughs> Get up. Have a break. Have a break. Go again. Go again. Oh, all good. You know. <laughs> Hi 
Yeah, have my man Daniel. He actually, you've been following the vlogs, yeah? Yeah, for a few months now, probably for six months. Sick, man. Good to, uh, good to see you again. I actually met Daniel, well, maybe a couple months ago. Correct, yeah. Do you want to take a photo of us if that's around the world? Yeah. Sore feet. It's real hot. <laughs> Little hobbit. <laughs> so we're up here, top of Temple, a week and a half into the street, everything's going pretty good. Um, just trying to, I don't know, be happy and vibey again after just, you know, everything that's just going to happen in the last few days. So, uh, what better way than to come up here to the sunny Temple Gym rooftop and, you know, go back to the roots and get some training. So, I mean, Jim's going to train some shoulders, but training downstairs, and we're like, nah, it's too nice a day to not come up here. So. Nice. Nice. Yee dog. It's absolutely killing it up here right now at Temple Gym. Shaping up a little bit. A week and a half deep. Just feels so good getting out here in the open and the sun. You know, the worst thing, like, I mean, this morning just lying in bed, depressed, kind of like, just didn't even want to, like, get out of bed, to be honest. It was just not really seeing the point of anything, but I think that's the worst thing you can do, you know, if you're going through rough times or grieving or depressed, like, as being kind of alone or in bed. It's just so important, I think, to just get active and, and get outside when you can. You know, me and Johan used to fucking train up here, like, We've trained up here a fair few times together, you know, just even off camera, like I didn't film every session we did. Just good good memories, you know, so many good memories. Get it. Yeah. Get it. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck me in the oh wake, pussy. <laughs> so bad. I need to get my gains back. Temple Gym, it's actually been a couple of days since that little roof workout. Training some legs here. This hairstyle, I tied it up in a bun. This is dedicated to Johan, for real. Actually, while we're here, you know, it's funny I just said that, and it's like, every time I fucking talk about it, it just kind of makes me, it puts me in a really bad mood, you know, like, it just makes me feel sad, and then I'm, I'm angry that I'm sad, and it's just, it's, a, it's real fucked up, eh, but, I don't know, it's a strange thing, like, grief, I guess, and like, it's just so many different emotions that you get, and it's just, it's weird, like, I'm trying, I've just been trying, like, not to think about this shit all week, but then I feel guilty for not thinking about it, but then as soon as I think about it, I start to feel, like, sad and upset and, and angry and shit, so then I'm like, I try not to think about it, it's just like a real mind fuck, so. Time for that cheat meal. We can stop. How is the shrimp going? Very well. I'm shredding up really fast. Too fast. Like, I need to eat more, I think. Really? Yeah. That's good. That's what you want. Better Snapchat that, babe. Watch your Snapchat. Gemma Jones. Oh. Is it Jack Fit Apple underscore juice. fitness? Yeah. yeah. Amy, could you just help me oh. on this? It's not working. I can even take the top off as well. Thank you. Alright, what is up everyone? So, uh, vlogs, this, I mean, this week of vlogging has just been pretty random. I've just been collecting, like, footage here and there, but just haven't really been, like, focused enough on, like, this is the structure of the video, this is what I'm going to film. You know, it's pretty much been, like, random clips thrown together. Um, just been a bit, you know, obviously you guys know I've been thrown off, but... Um, here we are, Temple Gym again. Hey, my training's going really good. Um, been fucking absolutely smashing it, and, you know, starting to really, you know, shape up. I really just, I can't complain. Everything's pretty much going, like, perfectly. According to plan, if anything, I'd say I'm even like leaning up almost too fast, but I'm thinking I could slow it down, but you know, I don't seem to be losing any muscle, so like, I'm just gonna keep riding the wave. <laughs> just for now, just just stay on the uh, what I'm currently doing and keeping that cardio up. I've uh, just been hitting that 40 minutes every single day. Currently just hitting some chest up here, again, on the roof of Temple Gym. Just training with my man Vitruvian Physique. He's, uh, he could be coming around here any minute. He's just um, gone down to buy a drink. He didn't quite get his Gatorade, but uh, what did you get, Igor? I just got some random protein drink beverage 
I'm like living exclusively on chicken breast as a protein source right now. So it's starting to get like really bad. So at this point, if I can have anything other than that, I'm pretty happy. Fucking hell, man. Fucking I want to see this beast in action. Precious. <laughs> the girl's actually gonna try to set up a shot here. I'm gonna be doing some flies on the bench. And he's gonna film me with the drone and then pull out and then show the uh, the scenery here. It's gonna look so really, really awesome as if, long as I don't fuck if it's um if we've succeeded, it'll be like right here if you click this. Well there's there's this channel anyway, keep an eye out for it. What do you think of Temple Gym, bro? Like just the outdoor gym, but it's not just an outdoor gym. It's actually, number one, it's quiet, it's nice. We're here at a reasonable time, it's like four o'clock on a Saturday. No one here. They got a decent set of equipment, a good, solid, basic, like hardcore gym. You got your dumbbells, you got your squat rack, you got your barbells, that's it. There's no need for this fancy stuff. You got this, you can, anyone could build a fantastic physique. I can hear it, but I can't see it. It's on the iPhone screen, eh? Yeah, it's just like, good luck. I know it's facing that way, and it's 68 meters away from us. Danny, are you ready to be vlogged? Yeah, man. A fair few people ask about this gym, Temple Gym. If uh, anyone wants to come come through for a train, what's the what, what's what's the deal for my subscribers? For all crazy subscribers, come on through. Um, Ten bucks a session. Easy. Yeah. Easy done. So you guys, like, I know a lot of you guys are coming over from like other parts of Oz for like to the Gold Coast for holiday and shit. A lot of the gyms they charge like twenty five bucks for you know your casual session. So. If, uh, if you come through to Temple, just mention that you're one of my subscribers. You get a session here for 10 bucks. 10 bucks, trade on this beautiful rooftop. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. It wasn't going back, it wasn't going forward. It was just, it was just done. That was good. Yeah, pretty decent chest workout today. I uh, haven't actually filmed too much of it. Like I said, my vlogs have been a bit all over the place, but yeah, it's watch tanks. Fortunately, bad news from my supply. I know I said they're gonna be in the restock with a new drop on February 9th, but had a bit of an issue with the supply, so we can't actually get these into May. My deepest apologies. I know it's fucking shit, like this is probably like one of the sickest things we've got right now, but you guys just need to be patient, but we've got some sick stuff in the drop you guys have seen in the next vlog anyway. Alright, so what is happening everyone now? I know this vlog's been completely all over the place. Uh, forgive me, the whole, everything's been thrown off. It's just completely out of routine and just, shit's been a bit fucked. Um, gym sees drop, February 9th. It was the plan for the this next drop and my week of hype is not gonna work unfortunately because I don't actually get to pick up the stock till at the earliest Friday it's looking and that's not even gonna give me a week to build up the hype with videos and all that kind of shit. But we need to get this drop going February 9th. So I'm just gonna have to show you guys now the drawn up designs on my laptop of what we're dealing with so you guys can like know what you want now to get excited about buying instead of like, so just so you can see it now. Just currently everything is really, the timing is really supposed to be pinpoint to the Arnold's, the Arnold Classic in March in Melbourne. We're doing that, Jim says is gonna be there, me, Jay, Gemma. The biggest expense of my life. I've never done anything like this. I mean, I've done like small expos and shit, but it's not like this. This is eight and a half thousand dollars for this empty space alone for the weekend, which is fucking absolutely crazy. Like, I can't even comprehend that, but I've put, everything at this all of december's sales everything it's gone reinvesting back into making the arnold classic happen in march call me fucking crazy but you know it's gonna be a good time i can't wait to be there can't wait to meet you guys put on something epic the way that i've balanced being able to do this arnold is by having this february launch be successful if this isn't successful and shit doesn't go to plan and i don't have money in the accounts at the right time i can't order the new stock for the Arnold's and I can't pay off the second half of the booth because I've paid half now. I've already paid our accommodation which is a couple of grand as well. Like so many expenses and shit, it's getting really stressful. But this launch needs to happen February 9th. Um, like ideally timing wise now, February 16th would be a much better launch but we need to do it Feb 9th just to get the finances be to, be, to match up so we can get this Arnold paid for. That's the bottom line, like finances when you're, when you're doing a business, that's, that's, your business will fucking die if you've got no money. I love it and I hate it and I wish this shit wasn't about money, 
but it is. If you want to make shit work, the numbers don't lie. And that's like a lesson that I've learned the hard way, fucking more times than I can imagine. Because I like to think of myself as in this shit for the right reasons, not someone that's in this just to make a, a quick buck, just to make profit, just to be rich and shit, you know, like, and that's what becomes hard in life when you try, have to, you know, when you come into situations where you have to make numbers work, it's a bit stressful. But anyway, I need to show you guys the designs online here for uh, for the drop that we're doing so you guys can get a taste of what we've got. Now note too, we've also got new one of 30s. Uh, you guys will see on the my Instagram or the Jim Steve's Instagram in the coming week. Uh, they're fucking dope, they're fucking dope. Like, yeah, like the last one of 30s, they sold out in I think about, I think it was like 12 to 15, I think it was, nah, it was like about 12 minutes like for the, the best sizes and I think there was like two smalls which lasted till the morning but even th th they went like the least popular sizes so you want to get in like right on the dot 7.30 Queensland when we do the launch you need to get them right on the dot if you want to get one of those so this is what we're dealing with some pretty dope shit just going with the standards uh, I'm not wearing one now, I thought I was wearing one now. Let's go with our standard panel, our box logo. So as you guys can see in terms of new items, we're dropping a white on white tank, a black on black tank, restocking the oatmeal tanks, pastel greys restocking. We've got an army green color, fucking super excited about this, the khaki. Restocking our black penalties. Now these two is what I'm really excited about, the pink penalty and the tan penalty. Fucking, oh my God, they're just, just so fucking pumped for these two. Restocking the pink prints, of course. Now you can't really see it here, but we've got a black on black panel tee and a white on white panel tee with a new uh, logo on there so very excited about these as well now we're also restocking the white tanks with the camo prints and we've got a black one dropping as well you can't really see it uh, it's hard to see on the camera here it's gonna be fucking stealthy as fuck so can't wait to drop those february 9th we're doing it 7 30 queensland time i'm gonna have a new vlog up for you guys in a couple of days thanks for your patience throughout this whole week it's been really fucked up on another note you know i've had suggestions people uh thinking you know do a singlet for Johan and stuff um, and donate you know the money towards his daughter to look you know help help out with that whole situation there um, really yes was so wanting to do that it's a, a completely gonna do that uh, currently for this drop unfortunately with the finances being so tight everything needs to fall in line for the Arnold so for this drop it's just gonna be everything you know the finances it's all going back into the business to fund the Arnold classic which we're doing and you know this month and making it a priority to come up with something some way that we can you know help out you know, Johan's daughter and just get some money in her like accounts which have been set up and you know there's been so much outreach and support already so it's fucking like really cool but yeah like uh, I've got some special designs I'm thinking like some vector work uh, artwork of you know Johan and so, like I've got some cool designs and yeah I'll keep I'll keep you guys updated with that or uh, I might talk to the AMPM boys if they've got um, if you guys don't know AMPM's like Johan's clothing line, Art of Motion Pursuit of Movement, it's more about like, it's more like a way of life than a clothing line, but it's a clothing brand as well. So if they've already got some stuff in the works, you know, I might be promoting that in any way I can, but uh, we'll see what happens. Yeah, so hectic week. Yo, I'm out, I'm out. I need to get this video uploaded. It's currently Tuesday, this is in real time now. We're up to date and I'll see you guys in the next vlog in a couple of days. Peace out, I hope you guys have a good week. I'm, I'm lost for words. Dab. All right, bye. Quickly I fell deep into your skin Somehow I lost control Now the cautious dive down with me to come undone Stay the night, stay up till morning sun